Looks like everything is live. Story I see you have a similar combat group. encounter. You and I are definitely brothers. And yet, I got all of the streak. You actually think you'll make it through the trial like this? Don't make me laugh, Luger. <laughs> the trial is cruel. Unbearably cruel. <laughs> and people are weak. Weak enough to ruin us all. You will come to understand. This is our curse. The gears of fate that grind the curse bind upon us an armor of death. It's a key and a lance that pierces space and time. Souls encircle the throne of the void. The branches of history reach out to infinity. Doing so well at this battle, it would seem. You alone must make the decision, brother. Everything rides upon this one choice. Not just your life, but the fate of the entire world. Do you have what it takes Yay. to destroy, to choose, to pass the trial? Answer me, Luger Krasnik! So, our story here begins with. Seemingly losing a battle with no context to what's going on. <laughs> it was all just a dream. Or was it? <laughs> Cat. Oh, crap! <laughs> Chapter 1, The Cogs of Fate. Cutting it a bit close, don't you think? Need I remind you that this is the Spurious Corporation's entrance exam? Goes. Did not think there was a choice this early. But you still barely made it on time? You're short on brains, but you've definitely got guts. that I killed you? Well, if you keep decimating my supply of tomato cupcakes, perhaps that dream will come true. Huh? Kidding. Anyway, time to wake up and smell reality. Let's begin, shall we? You'll be tested here, in the underground training area. These caverns stretch all the way to Triglef city limits. You could head straight out of town from here. I wouldn't, though. It's an automatic fail. Here, your weapons. Hmm, I see you have a similar combat grip. We're definitely brothers. Huh? 
The exam is live combat. Slay five of the monsters lurking in the training area and return before your time runs out. Spurious is not liable for any injuries sustained during the exam. But just between us, if things go bad, I've got your back. You're my brother. Thank me later. Here they come. All right. Dual blades here. enough. Start to fight in here. Doo -doo -doo -doo. What do we got? enough. We still got this pretty easily. enough five monsters have been dispatched the candidate has completed the assignment So now I guess we go back to the entrance. Yep. 
conducted our requisite RPG qualification exam. Combo move. I don't think we're really supposed to win this fight, but we're gonna win it anyway, because we're good like that. Easy fight, but nice to get that kind of. <laughs> so one the thing that Zillia Two has that uh, Zillia My did not hero. is here. Take this. Physical <laughs> damage types. Deception is commonplace on the battlefield. Didn't you think it suspicious the way she just appeared out of nowhere? We were testing uh, your situational I call analysis. The lame. Luger Kresnik. You failed. Boo. Right. <sighs> lame. Al, wait right there! He went downstairs. After him. Your pocket watch. Elm, you know how to read a clock, right? You need to get on the 10 o'clock train leaving from Triglyph Central Station. From there, head to the land of Canaan. To Canaan? It's a place where any wish can be granted. It's where you and I can finally live in peace. Place that grants wishes? You must go there, no matter how frightening it may be. Okay, I promise I'll go. Hurry! Get to the train, and then to Canaan! Shoot him, now! That's a measure of response. What about you? 
I'll meet you there, I promise. Got away. It doesn't matter. He's the key. What the? It is time. How's it going? Zillia 2 time. That's good. Glad to hear. I'm doing well. Doing well. Hey Luger, you alive in there? Chop chop. Had to salvage some old code this sleeping in on your first day of week, work this past week Smooth and move. managed to get it all Somebody's ready to for working order again when the code was about three years old, so that felt pretty good to accomplish. Really? I uh didn't think you were gonna say yes. You're gonna make a great chef someday, so give each meal your all. Hey, don't laugh at me. Anyway, I know they're gonna love your cooking at the station cafeteria. I eat it, and I haven't died yet. Huh. That's an interesting compliment. Cat. Looks we have like a cat. Lolo's hungry too. Let's eat. What's the special today, chef? So, trying to butter me up with tomatoes, huh? I'm onto your tricks. Doesn't mean it won't work. Ha. Huh. And how about you, Rolo? Fancy some deep fried canary, maybe? Or how about some diet kitty crisps? Gotta lift you from the knees, big boy. That cat does seem like it would be a lot harder than that to lift. Our top story. 
Production will begin today at the Oscor plant, a joint venture between the government and the Spurious Corporation. So, the, plant's projected the world of Olympias tells of Zillia, because of the way that game was somewhat rushed, wasn't really all that fleshed out. And, tells, and when they got the idea to do a Tales of Zillia 2 and flush out that world a, a lot more, the cream of Olympias will be on it hand, including works well for and it works well as a vessel for a ceremonial doing train, another huh? story with a new right set of characters in addition to the old ones. Hmm. Say, I should really give you something to celebrate your new job, shouldn't I? This old hunk of junk? Hey, if it's a watch you want, I'll spring for a new one. Well, how about a nice necktie instead? You'll be dealing with all sorts of folks at the station, you know. That'll look sharp. Whoops, I gotta run. <laughs> hmm? Catch you later. You should go, too. A train station employee running late is a pretty big faux pas. Yeah. Unfortunately. So there is a mechanism in New Game Plus where you can get them to speak. But all my PS3 save files were destroyed in the great PS3 crash of 2016, so I do not have data that will be good for that, unfortunately. I guess I could have, I could have dug for some online, but They've cracked down a bit on, like, just hooking flash drives up to your PS3 over the years, I think, as far as save data. Alright, to the train station. We won our first boss fight against a monster that was probably a bit above our intended level. You're the one who wanted to cover this event, Leia. Balin had to call in some favors just to get you a ticket. Me? I can't write the article for you. Besides, I don't even know which train they're using for the ceremony. I th hey. think the choice to have Wait. Mooger hung up on not me. speak now what am I supposed is to do? made in line with like a lot of self-insert <sighs> characters. Like your typical persona well, protagonist yeah, sure. if you doesn't don't mind. speak all their lines when you're responding to another character. You're and I think they were kind of paying attention to current trends in the RPG market and trying to follow that with Luger. Ten o'clock train. Ten o'clock train. And then they gave an option to have him talk in New Game Plus, which is unfortunately not always there. Hey, Mr. Kitty Cat, nice, do you know where but... to keep the big trains around here? Daddy called it Try Something Station. You're yeah, talking to a cat, mess. you wouldn't mess. know much about trains, huh?
Yeah. Commercial That's probably true too. District. The station. Hey, wait, Mr. Kitty Cat. You're going to the station too? I find it difficult to believe Rollo could run that fast, but I guess cats are quite fast. Thanks. I owe you one. Sure. I've been to Triglyph a bunch of times, but somehow I still always manage to get lost. <laughs> How about you? Were you heading to the station too? <laughs> Me? Just going on a little field trip. I was invited to the opening of the Oscorp plant. Wow. Oh, I'm not some great scientist or anything. I was only invited because an acquaintance of mine is involved. So, as a cafeteria insider, any takeout options you could recommend? Hmm. I've heard the Triglef Tri-Tip is something of a local delicacy. There. So that's the ceremonial train. Oh, huh? what's that? Ooh. Is that it? Yes, sir. A message from Vice Director Rideau. Suspicious activity observed in Crown. Please take caution. <laughs> He's going to attack us here. This will be some celebration. We have been expecting you, Mr. Bakur. I'm happy to say our departure is right on schedule. <laughs> Thanks for your help. I really appreciate it. Uh. <laughs> See you, Jude. that we can buy orange gels and they don't cost 11 trillion gold. But I'm busy here. If she's lost, take her to the station office. Uh, there's a little kid. Oh no. Sir, you'll need to follow me to the station manager's office. This young lady just told me you tried to lure her out of the train station. What? Huh? I did nothing of the sort, sir. You're not going anywhere. <laughs> Ow. You want to play well, rough? That's not going to go so well. Well, this is timely.
seems bad. <laughs> Cat! And also, person that tried to get me arrested. that wrong. <laughs> it's been a long time since I've played this, definitely. Alright, they have guns, so running backwards in a straight line, probably not the best idea. So, are the bad people gone now? Apparently I got too spoiled by Jude's backstep thing where he can worry, end up behind I'm every fine. enemy when he backsteps successfully. <laughs> and Luger does not have what those luxuries. Impressive, Dr. Mathis. Were those Rize Maxian martial arts? My security team could learn a thing or two from you. Then again, my security team can't channel spirits the way you Rize Maxians can. I'm just glad we were both on the same car. You know, you're not too shabby yourself. Thank my you. My name is Beasley Bakula. I'm CEO of the Spirius Corporation. Luger Kresnik, huh? You wouldn't happen to be related to Julius Kresnik, would you? I wonder. Wait, you your think name so? Is Kresnik? Yes, Sir, Jude. According to the As corporation files, of... Luger here is Director Kresnik's younger brother, though they don't share the same mother. That's good to know. So you're a part of the Spurious family, as it were. Yeah, I'll be there at the company picnic. <laughs> Those Exodus bastards have made their move. Exodus? Terrorists who exist. want trouble between the two nations. They've targeted us for supporting the government's peaceful policies towards Rize Maxia. I have no doubt they plan to ram the train straight into Oscorp. What? Wait, you mean this train? Stop the train? What are you gonna use, your feet? We could if we take control of the engine car. Sounds like a plan. You'll stop it. This I have to see. I'll help too. I have a stake in this. I'm impressed. My name is Jude Mathis. It's a pleasure to meet you, Luger. Come on. Alright. Theoretically, we have a party member here. Alright. Set up back here. How could anyone do this? The enemy could be hiding anywhere. You better proceed. Trench coat. Interesting name for apartments where two brothers live. I don't know that much French, but that at least 
an obvious jump out of me kind of thing. I won't hold back. <laughs> Okay. I'm apparently a lot worse at this than I was two weeks ago. Hey Luger, how are you fixed for Allium Orbs? Uh, I brought an extra one. Take it. You know about Allium Orbs, right? We've been using them ever since the Lilium Orbs transmutated. The orb will let us link to level up system. When we're linked, we can... Never mind. You'll see soon enough. Stay on guard! <laughs> <laughs> Links sure are useful. Yeah. Woo! Well, that's ominous, that amount of blood. Over already? Nice. There. Always good. Getting those dual arts off like that. Man, they did not mess around with their attacks on this train. If I must, I got your back. I got your back. Too easy. Good stuff. Quick, let me explain how to use Allium Orbs to develop your abilities. Lilium Orbs did that too, but these work a lot differently. Hmm? All Lilium Orbs quit working when they were overloaded with mana after the schism was dispelled. But we figured out that by feeding them elemental energy through an extractor, a kind of mana absorption spirex, we were able to resurrect them as Allium Orbs. Our linking and development capabilities were back in business. Uh, sorry for rambling on there. Why don't you just give it a shot? Look out! 
Do we send for reinforcements, sir? Wasting a chance to see the sort of person we're dealing with? Hardly. My watch is gone! Don't wander off, young lady. It's dangerous. I don't care! I gotta find it! I can't get to Canaan without it! Just when things couldn't get more interesting. So, hey. Hmm? Did you know that girl? Is it okay to leave her like that? Huh. Don't you think it's odd that a child that age would be traveling alone? I wonder if she got separated from her parents. Hmm. Well, I suppose we don't really have time to worry about that right now. Let's get going. This is nothing. Good stuff. Almost at the front car. Be on guard. Got it. Alright, the save point is a pretty good indicator that we have a boss fight coming up here. Up ahead's the conductor's room. I'll go in first. Meanwhile, you cover me, okay? Don't worry. I'm used to this sort of thing. Odd for a doctor to say, I know. Let's check it out. Right. doing here I'm doing my job <laughs> and a thorough job at that I'd expect nothing less from crown agent Julius you work fast enough with the games Bakur who would have known you had such a talented little brother? I'd heard they Aren't were talking about similar? potentially You've protected him looking well. at remasters because a lot of the library can't be played on any modern platform. Um, of course I did! 
Tales of Vesperia getting Come a remaster. On. Are you sure you have that to some this? To, for that one to some extent? But Zillia is only on the PS3. Graces is, <laughs> as far as I know, only Look on the out. PS3. Um, Abyss is only on the <laughs> PS2 and 3DS. We will never no, so there's a lot of them that would be helped by just a simple port. Like if they just basically port something like the Vesperia and call it a remaster. That would take care of a lot. Uh, I haven't heard anything about any remakes, but remaster. Yeah, yeah, I've. One thing I was. I've always been. I've been hoping for for a long time is a port of the Fire Emblem uh, Pelius games to the Switch. Like. Part of me was jokingly thinking that they would. Who are you? Add Micaiah to Smash Brothers and no, use no, that to. Look push out, the Atelius okay. games no, as a not. collection on Switch somewhat. I got weird and so did the watch. But I would definitely buy a Atelius collection for Switch, even though I just ran through Path of Radiance, Radiant Dawn semi recently. I would totally buy that. Weirdness. I didn't buy Four the spirits, Shadow Dragon spirits, no, direct yes. port of the NES game. I don't like Shadow Dragon that much, so. All clear, President Verland. Well done, Miss Nova. My security team could learn a thing or two from you. Deja vu. Luger, what are you doing on this train? Friend of yours? An old classmate. But luckily, I'm blessed to have all this hardware already. Look for and Julius, most of it's still he? in working order. Oh, the guy with the glasses? It did seem like he knew what was going on here. I'm coming too! It's too dangerous. Maybe, but I gotta take this train all the way to the land of Canaan. Apparently, 3DSs are legend? now getting, like, You've heard of it? extremely you know expensive, is? which is it's so weird. It's manuscripts. like, manuscripts. I gotta imagine they were okay, still selling come. some when amount of volume starts. of them, like, before they just stopped making them. Just on like potential to play all those 3DS and DS games. Okay, all systems. Like I have means of recording so try to stay all the Game Boy okay? stuff up to Game Boy Advance, but no means of recording any of my DS and 3DS libraries. I suppose I could do look into stuff like I did for my PSP to make backups of my games and emulate, but have not done that yet. Part of that is that my PSP hardware was kind of on the fritz and needed to be be plugged in because of battery issues. And my DS and 3DS haven't had those problems. So I never felt the need to look into them, but if I was ever going to Over already? stream something from those libraries, it might be good to have. Ah, uh, dang. I do have plans for streaming Tales of the Abyss, but that will be the PS2 version and not the 3DS version, despite the bug fixes in the 3DS version. I got your back. Too easy. There. And I think my next Fire Emblem game for the screen is going to be Sacred Stones. Since Game Boy Advance recording has gone quite well for the Golden Sun stuff. Is that your cat? Yeah. I thought she was with that girl. I'm not afraid. I'm not afraid. Hey, L 
Bell's all alone, isn't she? you to care huh nothing ouch ouch you know the way you look there it was really freaky you looked like a bad guy wow it reminded me more of a spirit that wasn't like any spirit I've ever heard of spirits are mysterious beings that act as conduits between people and nature they're rare here on Olympias but they're quite common where I'm from in Rizamaxia. Freaky things like that are common? Spirits oh do command great power, but they're no enemy to us. And I assure you, El, Luger's neither scary nor a bad guy. I mean, he looks after his cat, doesn't he? Is that true? This is nothing. Oh, I learned something and skipped too fast. Swift strike. Okay, what is that? Oh, nice. Critical hit on a stunned enemy. I can work with that. Let's do this! Remember how that feels. Good stuff. Thought I'd to get reminded of how Mystic Arts work in this game. Hey, but... what about you? Are you okay? No injuries? It is nice that the tutorials are skippable. Take note, Pokemon. Azure 
goes on forever. I think this is the end of the line, though. Why is he here? What? Cat. Stand back. Let me handle this. You don't need to know. I said you don't need to know! Luger! Employees like this? You! Hurry and finish him off! What are you waiting for? You'd spare this monster's life! I know you have a, a kind heart. And that's right!
bad news. The brakes have been sabotaged. <laughs> well, we're leaving this dimension anyway. What's going on? Wasn't a very good dimension to begin with. That's the end of chapter one. Our top story. Terrorists hijacked a train meant for today's festivities and crashed it into the Oscorp plant. The number of well. casualties is still unknown at present. Authorities suspect the attack was an assassination attempt Conducted by members of Exodus, the terrorist organization that opposes peace with Riza Maxia. They're calling it an assassination attempt. Nasty business. You're in Duval. I found you all lying on the side of the tracks. The hospitals were overflowing with injured. Full as they were, I had little choice but to carry you here for treatment. Mr. Rideau, how are Luger and Elle coming along? Oh, you're awake. Any aches or pains? The treatment worked without a hitch. For both of them, I might add. Wow, Spurious's medical agents really are tip-top. I'm flattered by the compliment, truly. But our medical spyrics are simply superior to your spirit arts, that's all. Uh, Leia? No, no, don't worry, I'm fine. I'd better take this. Sorry to interrupt all the excitement, but the bill for your medical treatment comes to 15 million gold. What? Oh, it might sound excessive, but can you really put a price on saving a life? But I don't have any money at all. With the proper work ethic and a bit of elbow grease, anyone can make money if they try, even you. Being a child is hardly a valid excuse. Whoa, don't tell me you're resorting to literal strong-arm tactics now. Really, Luger, you'll need to behave better if you plan to fit in around here. <clears throat> Excuse me, I'm looking for Mr. Rideau. Ah, perfect timing, Miss Nova. This woman works for Verland Bank. Luger, what are you doing here? Is this loan for you? It's up to you whether or not to accept it, of course. In any case, we're talking about a small fortune. <laughs> Consider your options.
Not to pressure you unduly, but have you reached your decision? <laughs> You've made a wise decision. Are you sure? Sorry about that. The call ran long. Hey, what are you doing? Oh, he's just taking out a little loan to cover his medical obligations. This bill is huge! Did anyone tell you what'll happen if you sign that? Basically, you'll be tracked via GHS. They'll be monitoring your finances around the clock. You won't be able to buy a stick of gum without them knowing. A lot of debtors can't manage their money. Lots of them squander the cash they should be using to pay us back. Those deadbeats waste their money and their lives. But Luger uh. here isn't a deadbeat, is he? That doesn't... Or maybe you're saying you'd like to cover his bill. That's not quite what I was... Besides, not to be gauche, but haven't Medical you sunk every last get pretty gold expensive. into your spy right research? Hold on, Luger. There's gotta be another way. Well, you could always try mooching off of a family member. A solidly employed older brother, for example. <clears throat> wow. Hey. Pleasure doing business with you. I will transfer the amount of 20 million gold into Mr. Rideau's account. Hey, wait! I forgot to include your veterinary fees. My apologies for the oversight. Please don't tell me we ended up paying an extra five million for See the cat. See if you ever need follow-up treatment. I'll even give you the frequent patient discount. Luger, please don't look so glum. It's my job to help you pay off your loan. That means we're partners now. All right, so we have a lot of debt. you holding the bag on that loan. So Jude, you're broke too, huh? I've been researching ways to replace the current Spyrex. I got stumped, and the bills piled up. Jude's used what to being do do broke. It happened all the time That's in Zillia, okay. because we always bought I expensive have to go weapons. There. You could come with me. Where? Canaan. It's a place spoken of in fairy tales and ancient spirit legends. They say the spirit that reigns over the cycle of reincarnation dwells there. It's a place full of magic, and it can grant any wish that you make. No, it's true. Daddy told me so. How come you don't believe me? Perhaps Canaan is more than just a mere fairy tale. According to legends I've encountered, the sage Kresnik traveled to the land of Canaan, wielding the Lance of Will. What? You've got the Lance! If the Lance really exists, Maybe Kanan does as well. But what in the world was that? <clears throat> El, how do we get to Kanan? I... I don't know. My daddy just told me to get on the train, so I did. A lost little girl. I feel bad for her. I guess 
guess I could. I mean, you still need to give me back my pocket watch, so... Anyway, that creepy guy with the glasses sounded like he knew something about Kanan. Julius. Kresnik. Luger, was that really your older brother? What do you mean you don't know? <laughs> Have you tried calling his GHS? All right. I'm sorry. The GHS you are trying to reach is currently unavailable. Please try again. <sighs> we might as well head back to your place. If your brother's safe, he's bound to show up eventually. You're gonna come with us to Canaan, aren't you? I am something of a do-gooder. Uh -huh. He says you don't smell like one. Huh. Well, thank you. Hey, aren't you gonna tell me the kitty's name? All right, first things first. Let's catch a train back to Triglav. Another train? All right. I realize we have quite a bit of debt here, but... That's not gonna stop me from upgrading my weapons. Pretty much, pretty much. Yep, yep. I should be able to do all the endings when reasonably I came to, enough. Rado had already finished treating us. I trusted him because he said he worked for Spurious. I had no idea he um, would be like that. It's definitely possible on a first playthrough. This is my treasure, but we could sell it. What is it? This. If you sell it, we can pay our debts. It's lovely, but it's just a seashell. It isn't worth anything? It took me a whole day to find it. There's two other endings she was just outside of the true right? ending as it's well. It's not like you two are dating. <sighs> Nova here, and my ears are burning. Luger's up. ringtone Luger, is the battle Luger, theme Luger, "Eternal Luger. Mind" from Tales oh, of Eternia. She knew. Maybe she is close with Luger. Anyway, just calling a chat. You know, just a personal phone call. I hadn't seen you in forever, and we didn't even get a chance to catch up. You know. I know things back there got a wee bit awkward, but it was really great to see you again. Don't be a stranger, all right? Toodles! She sure is hyper. Mm-hmm. That was weird, though. She was on that train with us, and yet, just now, she acted like that didn't even happen. Mm. Freshly broke off buying expensive gear, so we're not paying our medical bills anytime soon. Looks like the train's over there, and we're not allowed to travel places. So broke. All right, we've got two gold.
Welp. No tickets for you. We're not allowed to travel until we pay our debt. This man's travel privileges have been put on restriction. That's how it come. If I let him pass, I'll be in hot water. Whoops. Looks like I forgot to read you the fine print about your loan. You know how Olympias manages personal information using GHS, right? Well, stuff like one's criminal Enter record black. or death can trigger travel restrictions. The trigger system was put in place to prevent debtors from trying to make a break for freedom. Huh? Pretty harsh, isn't it? Sorry you had to find out the hard way. But it's only temporary. As you pay off your debt, the travel restrictions are gradually lifted. We'll figure it out. You'll be fine. Anyhow, toodles! Alright, come on. You're blocking the other customers. Oh, uh... Sheesh. I wonder what trouble he got into. His life's over before it even started. Tough break. Shut up, you big meanies! You don't know anything about it! Wow. Let's get out of here, Luger! We can look for work around town. All right, chapter two. This is the first of these, and probably the only one where it's not just knocked out by doing character quests, where you have to pay a sum of money to be able to travel to the next area. Most of the ones later in the game, you'll just do character quests that are available to you, and you'll get some amount of gold by doing that, and that'll be more than enough to pay the toll. But this one has a kind of tutorial. They kind of want you to struggle a bit with the. Luger, you and Julius live together, right? Just the two of you? <coughs> uh, I mean the two of you and Rolo. So the three of you. Yeah. <coughs> That's just like me. Me and my daddy live together. When I was little, there was an old cat called Taddy that lived with us, too. Where do you live, El? <sighs> I promise we won't tell your enemies. I don't even know. The boat I was on stopped, and there were all these crates there marked to Triglav. I Whoa. hid in one, and that's where I ended up. So you don't know how to get back home. Hmm. <sighs> it's so hard to find good help these days. Oh, what? hey! You know it. Over here! You guys looking for work? You In bet. fact, we are. It's your lucky day. I've got jobs coming out the wazoo. I'm talking Thanks, spurious corporators quest, here, so you know each gig is a gold mine. At least if you're not an amateur. Worth a shot, right? We'll back you up. <laughs> Sounds like a plan. High road we go. Let's <laughs> go. 
unfortunate. Can we check our current jobs? Ah, we can't fast travel yet. Well, Jobs, honestly, give you gold pretty fast. Yes. 
I was going to try and get through chapter 2 tonight, but I'm not sure. But I guess I'll do the jobs and that'll be the end of chapter 2. Getting home. I'll help. I got your back. Let's be sure to keep this up. If I must. Do a 
sweat. Man, that's a lot of damage for such a simple attack. Ready? We only need to pay 5,000 and we're already at 3,500, but we haven't even turned into jobs yet, so... People really do overstate the amount that the debt easy. actually has an influence on the flow of this game. Like, it's a, it's a slight interlude between chapters, and people act like it's some huge thing. I can do this!
I see, it's the elemental ore that improves these things. Jude's gonna learn our good friend Palm Strike soon. That's how that works with the skill system. That's cool. More of an incentive for picking up the random loot in areas. Mutton, fresh mutton. Does she? Nope. All right, so we got all the jobs done. We geared up a bit. And head to the train station. Take our little train. But first, we save the game. we're going to be putting on a Phantom Thief mask. Yes. 
We are slightly less broke. glad we made it back safely. There's something comforting about coming back here. I certainly have vivid ones. This is where we came when we first arrived at Olympias. Everything about Triglef surprised me. Huh? Like what? Hmm. Well, for one thing, we'd been fighting on a different plane of existence when a rift opened up and we were sucked into it. What? Next thing I remember, I was waking up in a bed, surrounded by objects I'd never seen before. I was surprised by, well, how much there was to be surprised by. What surprises me is how happy you look when you're telling that story. Sets of apartments here. Ok. 
Okay, that's good to know that they put the different apartments on the same map in this place. Interesting. save after these scenes, but... Is this Julius's house? You live here, Rolo? No! Freeloader? That's like a deadbeat, right? So, now what? The cat's got a point. I think we're all running on fumes. Corey, uh, it's time for everyone well. to go to sleep. Hm. Why are grown up so hot on tomatoes anyway? My daddy likes them too. Thanks, Luger. It's so yummy. I feel like I'm eating at a restaurant. Hey, you cook as good as my daddy. Speaking of your father, Al, do you know where he is? No. Some scary men came to our house. I ran away by myself. <laughs> That's why I'm going to the land of Canaan, so I can wish for my daddy to get rescued from those guys. Do pardon the intrusion, Luger. Mr. Bacor, I'm glad to see you're okay. I'm one of the lucky ones. No way. Surprise, phony! Oh, this cloud again. I guess not. Ivor. <laughs> You're quite an amusing little fellow, aren't you, Ivor? I could use a comic genius as one of my junior agents. <laughs> Thank you, sir. They just had to bring him back. What's this all about? You haven't been watching the news, I take it. New details have emerged about the terror attack, during which a train was hijacked and then crashed into the Oscorp plant. The collision caused a massive explosion that ripped through the facility. More than 2,000 casualties were reported, including passengers and employees alike. Damages are said to exceed 10 billion gold, and experts estimate a final cost of at least 50 billion. Authorities identified That's the alleged mastermind gold. behind the attack. An employee of Spirius Corporation, one Julius Kresnik. <laughs> what the? But Julius couldn't have... Couldn't have what? He attacked me at the scene of the crime for crying out loud. The police believe Kresnik didn't act alone. They're investigating persons of interest. Take a wild guess which person is the most interesting. So the suspect brother just trouble. happened to start his job at the station on the day of I the attack. Remember that? Then he vanished with the suspect. Coincidence? If you're telling the truth, then prove it. Apprehend Julius. Then the facts are sure to come to light. What? 
Sounds like a plan. Scary glasses guy. Looks He's like we've got a plot. He contacted the CEO's GHS several hours ago. Huh? He's one of my top agents and far too skilled to fall into police custody. Around his little brother, on the other hand, he just might let his guard down. Well, Luger, what do you say? If you agree to catch him, I'll at least keep the police from getting in your way. <laughs> A decisive lad. You've made the right choice. Luger. As of now, you are under Spirius Corporation's protection. We have a pair of promising leads. First, your brother made contact with a researcher in Helioborg named Balin. Second, sources allege someone in Marksburg has been asking a lot of questions about Julius. Balin? How am I supposed to remember all that stuff at once, huh? So you want us to check out Helioborg in Marksburg, is that it? Guess we're gonna keep doing random jobs. Also, you really there's a gigantic monster doing any work? Chapter. Honestly, now, so. I thought Julius had raised you better than that. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Ivor, you never told me you knew Dr. Mathis. It's a long story. Hey, why are you going through all this trouble? I know the surface of this man, but that is not enough. Now, I must measure his depth. Chapter 3, It All Falls Apart. The End. What? Oh. Luger Wait, seems what? like he's down on his luck. You and me will have to work extra hard to compensate. Is that like a thing that happens? Ah, okay. Anyway. I never imagined that'd be how I'd run into Ivor again. How do you even know that freak? And why huh. does he drop down on people like that? Yeah, sorry about that. <laughs> how can you laugh about it, Luger? He knocked you on your butt like it was nothing. <sighs> Ivor's a very skilled warrior. As Maxwell's handmaid, he had to be. Maxwell's handmaid? It's kind of a long story. I see. Sounds complicated. Yeah. It shouldn't have been, but it was. Even though we both wanted the same thing. Okay, we got a save point here. And that's gonna do it for tonight. Everyone should go to sleep, but we will be back this week with more Tactics Ogre, then Golden Sun Friday this Sunday, next weekend. Have an excellent night, everybody.